Now I'm now going to show you how to waterproof your jackets. Um, now forget your silicone sprays and stuff like that. They, they're no good. They're a waste of money. And uh, your Nick Wax is all right for waterproofing your, um, your, your Gore-Tex jackets and uh, your waterproof jackets like that. But what about your army style jackets or um, someone's dog? <laughs> Or your, if you've got a genuine army jacket, or your hunting jacket, stuff, stuff like that. Uh, well, as far as I'm concerned, the best way, I think, is to wax them. And uh, I'm now going to show you how to do that. Now, I suppose you could use any old wax, like a candle or something, but uh, it would be a bit encumbersome. So um, I'll be using this one. I feel Raven and uh, I suppose there's others very similar to it as well I should imagine um, this is my old one that uh, I've only got a bit left so for the film I'm gonna use a nice new one okay okay get your jacket on the ironing board this is well this is how I do it put it on the ironing board as if you're just about to iron it and uh, flatten it out nicely and get your wax and just rub it on vigorously you're finished it should look a bit like this with all white wax all over it and you're probably thinking oh my god what have I done I've ruined my jacket but you haven't it's all right I'll try and when you wax it try and get under all the little crevices like that and like that and these and this here and what have you and uh, I suppose the next step, you could iron it on and melt it in, but I think the best way is to uh, get your missus's hair dryer and run the hot air over it. And if she doesn't want you to use it, wait until she's out and then you can use it and don't tell her. <laughs> That's the best way. So there you go. The next bit is to get your dry hair dryer, your missus's hair dryer and melt it in. Here we go. result and as you can see it just goes back to normal 
Uh, I can honestly say I didn't do these bits. I did the other side, but I did this bit and you can see it's very, it's just the same really. Might be a tiny, tiny bit darker, but not much really. That's just the light. And uh, you might even see little dark little bits like that going over folds it's not much really but uh, it feels quite stiff a little bit sort of waxy and uh, yeah it's quite nice I'm sure it will improve the waterproofness of the jacket so there you go that's how you uh, wax uh, a jacket that's made of cloth like this the military jackets or the hunting jackets or fishing jackets, whatever you want to call them. That's how you do it. That's how you wax your jacket.